in New York for almost three years now. And you're here in what I think is the world capital of art making right yeah. now. This I mean, a lot, of it, a lot of it was, I mean, art related stuff, you know. That brought you here? Yeah. So working in Brooklyn, are you but, extracting things from the community that helps you as an artist? Yeah, I mean, I think this whole city just, in gen just generally speaking, is inspirational. Every, just everything, just even just everyday life, just walking around the city, difference between being in, in Minneapolis and here, like I, you know, see all these crazy shows on just online, and now I can actually experience them in New York and see all my favorite artists at openings and see sure. their see their work in person, and you know, I've even been able to meet some people and make connections. I take a drawing and I, I you know, put it on transparencies. So with half of this work, you see like this piece here, this piece here is is straight from a drawing. And then I'm taking that and, and almost abstracting it, you know. Sure. Like these pieces up here, these two in the middle, those are from one drawing, but they're, it's just a tiny little glimpse of the drawing. So it's, it's a piece as a whole originally, but then I'm just taking like, you know, one little, one little tiny piece of that and blowing it up. So those paintings are a lot different. The process is like very sure, you know, and obviously, and dry. I mean, honestly, in a way, they're they're almost like self portraits in a way. Uh huh. <laughs> so depending upon the mood of the moment. I mean, it depends on the character and depends on what it is. But yeah, yeah, yeah. Of it's, course, it's kind of what they almost end up being. And I can't wait for people to see what we're showing and to see how they respond to it. And I'm thrilled. Yeah. Thanks for having us today, man. Absolutely. We'll see you soon. For sure.